Yes, I started. <laughs> Hence the easy now. Nice. Somewhere. I don't know where it was, but this is how what happens to you have cards. <laughs> <laughs> just like, Probably. Like a gambit. Just... Nice. 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 Are you ready to formally start? Yeah, I mm -hmm. think so. Who's going first? Well, we had to do the, 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 oh, yes. the whole goals. intro bit. Yeah. You know, so okay. we're doing the 200 subscriber shout out for Alex Big Blue, a local, I don't know why it's a local, but a comic book channel on YouTube. A local comic book channel on YouTube. <laughs> I don't know where he lives, but that <laughs> could maybe. be local. It's local on YouTube, right? We're probably in the same country. Does that make it local? <laughs> uh, stretch the definition a little <laughs> yeah, bit. Okay. So uh, I think he's already past 200. I think so, but good for him. He's doing this giveaway. The rules, which I wrote on a note card, but have since misplaced that note card. I think I can do this off the top of my head. You have to be 18 years or older, subscribe to his channel, shipping in the United States and Canada, and the, the fun part is that you have to take two characters and amalgamate them into one new character. Now, he said that you can draw it, you can show two covers, just create your character and, uh, you know, go with that. So... And we got one of each. Yeah, we are each doing an amalgamated character. So well, I'm saying you are doing two covers. I'm doing two covers. Justin drew his and Jessica photoshopped hers. Yes. So you get the whole gambit of creativity <laughs> here. <laughs> so, who wants to go first? Because, I mean, mine's probably the least entertaining, um, so I can go first I if I need to. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Okay. This was this was tough for me. So, uh, but I think, Justin, if anybody can appreciate my character, it would be I'm me. sure I will. So, I was thinking, what if you took Bruce Wayne, okay, and gave him web powers? Oh, cool. See where I'm going <laughs> yes, with this? Yes, I do. We could call him... Spider-Man. <laughs> I just kidding. That's not my okay. character. Oh, okay. <laughs> but I, I, this was tough for me. For some reason, I could not mix two characters. So I just thought, what would I want to read? And the closest thing I can come up with is taking Bruce Wayne and having his focus more on detective skills and trying to solve murders and find criminals and thugs and all this. And when he finally catches up to them, he has Ghost Rider's stare. Oh, cool. The, the condemning stare that judges them. So I'm combining Bruce Wayne with the spirit of vengeance. Okay. So that he gets that stare. So he tracks down criminals. You know, does he kill them or does he just fry their brains real good? You know, it's a fine <laughs> line, but he doesn't necessarily have to break his one rule. That's less damage than Ben Affleck did. So we're good. <laughs> That's fair. So my two covers. It's a detective comics, which I thought would be fitting since I want the detective aspect. And then if you watched our 200 giveaway for comic mags, then you saw this Ghost Rider cover. Because he's hot on the pursuit, making him sweat. So I thought the two covers at least made sense. Now as for a name, that is the hard part. Do I... Um, Ghost Man is a good one. Well, Bat Rider, of course, is well, another classic. Even if he went with Bruce Wayne, it could be uh... Bruce Wayne, Spirit of Vengeance, Death uh, Bat, Death Bat. <laughs> All right, we'll call him Death Bat. Oh, I Ghost like that. Wayne. Ghost Wayne. Wayne. <laughs> That's his second series. Bruce so, Rider. Bruce Rider. Uh, <laughs> this sounds like a regular nickname. It does. does. Point. You guys have fun with that, but I like the character of the detective who you know condemns them right then, like judges them, sees their sins, judges them there. That is neat. That actually would be a good comic to read. I guess I'll, I'll go next if okay. you're done. Yeah. Um, so I wanted to incorporate two of my favorite characters, but two that are a little bit more on the outskirts of the top ten. Um, so not my Spider-Mans and my Batmans and my Wolverines, you know. So I went with War Machine and also probably not super well-known X-Man. You may know him from having super cheap comics in the dollar bin. <laughs> but oh, I've always... 50 cent bin. 50 cent bin, my bad. But I've always loved that character. So I took two covers. I also did a drawing, but this is one of my favorite War Machine covers. I think I got this from Cartersville Comic Con. And then yeah. I brought uh, X-Man number one, which is... This is probably my favorite X-Man cover. I actually really love that cover. Alright, so 
I mix the two together. I tend to do a drawing. It's not that great because That's I haven't great. really drawn consistently since I was like 12. And I figured I had two naming options. It was either going to be War, War Man, War, War Man <laughs> or X Machine. I went with X Machine. That does sound cool. War Man sounds like he's a 1950s like, golden <laughs> age. Yeah, so um, anyways, so I, I tried to incorporate two characters that are also very different. I'm trying um, to get this to focus, but it just wants <laughs> to... Pan over so we do have um, armor. He's wearing armor, but I had to cut the top off so like that hair could come out and you could see the white streak maybe. <laughs> He's um he's got like his telekinesis telepathic type powers, but he's also learned how to combine this with technology for maximum results. And he's got the shoulder cannon, which is yeah. always a nice feature. We'll have Jessica get a picture of it. Maybe okay, and I can yeah, put that's it fine. On the video. <laughs> Let me make sure it's still in focus for you guys. X machine. Right, hopefully we're still in focus. X machine. So with mine, I didn't really think about the powers. I just figured they combine powers. Yeah. I didn't think too specific like y'all girls did. I um, you. But I went with, if you saw the top five video, Colors, yeah. um, I went with two of those characters. Originally, I wanted to do something like my top two, like Spider Gwen and Batgirl. But as you pointed out, it wouldn't work too well because you even said some of the names you were like, um, what did you say, like Spider Girl? Yeah, Spider um, Girl. There Already was taken. Back win. Back win. Back win or something. Didn't hit back win. Yeah, but no, I went with um, Witchblade and Swamp Thing. So, did you want to see that? Yeah. So oh, I tried that is cool. Doing something like that. That is really cool. I just did this on Photoshop, so maybe you can pop up the thing too. Yeah, I'll put the picture up also. There we go, because this is just from my phone. Good. Yeah, it would not focus on your yeah. notebook, man. It kept trying to focus um, on your face, I think. Like I said, I didn't think too much about their powers other than they'd combine powers. They'd both have. Well, you and I were discussing, because at first the name we came up with was Swamp Witch. Yes, and I think that's still the name I like. Um, because otherwise, if I wanted to... Oh, my bad. Yeah. If I wanted to combine the names, I mean, there's a Witch Thing... Which thing? Which thing? Swamp Which thing? Blade? Swamp Blade was our runner up. Yeah. Which Swamp thing Blade. is, yeah. Which thing is Which funny. Which thing? It could be which thing, but I kind of like Swamp Witch. Swamp yeah. Witch sounds like it would be. Well, I wanted to make a joke and the way that it's a I sandwich. Made it. Swamp Witch. <laughs> You'll probably bump yeah, it up. Like and the way I made it, though. <laughs> I figured Swamp Witch. Yeah, yeah I, I like it. it. I, I like it a lot. Made her hair longer and stuff, too. Um, we, we were talking about Spider Gwen and Swamp Thing. How naming matters because we came up with swamp spider, yeah, which was yeah, you know just a which... giant <laughs> like spider in a swamp, yeah, or um, what was the other one? spiders, spider swamp, which just yeah. sounds like it's a swamp full, full of spiders, spiders. yeah. <laughs> so naming it was, matters, it does, and it was kind of tough deciding what to do, but I was like, these two would be cool. I like um, swamp witch though. I do too. That's my yeah. favorite. That sounds like it's got some lore to it. Oh yeah. But that is our character creations. Hopefully you guys enjoy them. The videos that I've watched, people have people have really been creating some cool characters. So hopefully you guys enjoy our characters. Go subscribe. Did we do other two shout outs yet? Yes. Or oh, you did two at the beginning. Did you? We shouted out two other channels. You did it this one I thought for because you said or You're talking about the person who's putting on the front. Yeah, I, oh, I said oh, I Alex Cooper was putting. So my two people I would do would be um, Alex the Comic Quarter. Always has amazing hauls. I was just watching his Golden Age haul that he got. Sorry, our cat is not hollering. Um, I was just watching his Golden Age haul, so just amazing books there. And then my other person I would shout out is Reggie Collects because... Uh, not only does he have hauls, he's got cool speculation videos um, on top of just useful information for pressing and sending books to get graded, and he does weekly giveaways, so he is a, an amazing part of our community. So I would check out those two channels on top of all the channels we just shouted out um, for Comic Mag's giveaway. So make sure you watch that video if you need more suggestions. Are you shouting anybody out? Oh, well, I'll shout some out. We got... Lethal Lighting 2, um, Marvelettes 2020, and Devil Comics Entertainment. Check out all of those. 
um, Devil Comics Entertainment looked like they had a really cool video and they've... Um... Hey everybody, so as we've mentioned in the past, this camera cuts off after 10 minutes of recording and that happened and we didn't notice it. So now your outro is post-narration. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check out all the channels we mentioned in this video and go support Alex Big Blue uh, as he has now passed 200 subscribers, I'm pretty sure. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day, everybody.